several different tests and um, these might be split up into several different videos. I don't know yet, but um, I will find out what I'm editing. We're gonna be doing something called a arterial Doppler. And what that is is basically an ultrasound and I believe it's like over my arms and my legs and all that stuff. Um, I'm kind of mad at myself because I was gonna bring some extra pants because um, they told me that she doesn't clean and I believe them, but I'm still weird and I don't want to have like sensory issues of it being a little bit damp with my dry lit pants. I don't know. It's an autism thing. Um, I'm going to butcher the test probably, but it's called an MST and it stands for Metabolic Stress Test. Basically, they're going to put me on some kind of like exercise bike. So they told me to bring, I mean, to wear comfortable clothing, which I always wear comfortable clothing, so I'm good there. But um, yeah, I hope this goes well. Maybe I can record it. Um, We'll see. The technicians are a little bit, um, what do you call it, less strict on the recording rule. I was supposed to do the halter loop yesterday, which is a heart monitor that I'm supposed to be wearing for like 24 hours, I think. But the reason I didn't do it yesterday is because I'm going to be on an exercise bike today also. The um, heart monitor would have had to be taken off because this, the um, exercise bike would have um, fucked with the results. So we had to do it today. So um, we're going to do that today instead of get, having it done yesterday. But yeah. Um, I'm going to ask for like a hypoallergenic... Um, what do you call it? My brain is awful today. Not tape, but like a monitor itself. But I'm even allergic to those. I'm gonna get red no matter what, and it's gonna be itchy, and I'm, I'm gonna wanna like just rip it off, but I'm not gonna be able to. But um, I've done one before, so I can think I, I'm pretty sure I can do it again. It's just gonna be in a big, huge annoyance. But anyway, I will update you when I'm right there. shorts on me they're so like not sensory friendly we just finished the um, sonogram on my legs it was looking for um, like my arteries to look for other aneurysms different aneurysms on different parts of my body I hate doculars I hate sonograms they fucking hurt so I'm glad that it's over we're gonna be doing an MST test now so wish me luck Hey, so I'm in the bathroom because it's really um, crowded in the office today and majority of the time it is and I don't like want to be in there and, and talk in front of everybody to a camera because it just it feels so fucking weird um, and just feels very obnoxious. But I just finished my, um, M, what is it called? MST test. It was awful. They put this huge thing in my mouth and I actually, in the end of the test, ended up throwing threw up inside of it, which was fun. And I'm sure the lady is going to have fun cleaning that up. Someone came in the bathroom, so I came out in the hallway because, I don't know, I just feel very self-conscious today for some reason. But I'm so fucking glad this MST test is done. Um, if I knew how awful it was going to be, then I would have, like, stressed out about it more, which wouldn't have helped me, but I would have. So, I don't know. Super excited that I get to go home now. So I got home finally. It's been about an hour since I've gotten home. Um, I wish I could go to sleep, but I have another appointment tomorrow, so I have to stay awake so that I can be awake for it tomorrow. But um, the exercise bike, basically, um, I told you the long ass name that it has. It's an MST test. Um, went awful. Like it went well, I guess, but it was like 
I felt awful afterwards. Um, I felt bad during the tilt table test and afterwards, but I know I like it wasn't as near as bad as this test because like I was actually actually exercising and they needed you to get to a certain type of like speed I guess but I never would able, was able to get up to that speed I was able to get up to 40 which is 10 um, less than what they wanted but I couldn't keep it and it kept as you went it kept getting harder and harder and I I'll show you a picture but I had to wear this awful it was just a it was just a stupid looking vest um, wasn't comfortable that thing that had to go in my mouth like it had things to bite on but it also had to go in your lips it was very it was very weird um, but um, I am wearing a heart monitor right now which hold on it's one of these um, I've got the one with the five leads on it well I can't see for some reason I'm putting it up to my screen and not the actual camera lens Reese's you need to get out of here you're making too much noise so I have the one with the five leads but um, I have the one with the five leads so all of the little leads are on where those dots are on this one so that's where they are at um, and I have them pulled up out of my shirt because them touching my skin is awful um, but this is basically what they look like they're just I'm sure you've seen them before little stickers um, but they're I've got three more on my body um, and I've worn a heart monitor before um, basically what you do is I have if I have an event um, I would press the event button and then, um, what do you call it, go through the little green buttons and find the, um, one that you, um, I can't think, I'm sorry, the, the, find the symptom that you're feeling. And so basically I'm feeling shortness of breath right now, so I'm going to show you, and showing you is going to be a little bit hard because I'm going to be doing it through my screen. Yeah, this is not going to be easy. Okay, so I press the vent, vent button, and then it does this. Can you read it? The cord's getting in the way. Okay, so then I press... Let's see what that says. Yeah, shortness of breath. So, press enter. And it's recorded. I don't think it recorded, though. I'm leaving this heart monitor on for 24 hours and then I'm going to and then tomorrow I'm going to bring it back to them and I have more tests for, for to do as always you know your body better than anybody else please listen to it thank you for staying alive have a nice night bye